eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We have liftoff. Go Super Heavy. Go Starship. Thanks for all the historic flights, Pad 1. Pitching downrange. Booster Raptor chamber pressure nominal. Engines throttling down. Who's ready to cut off? Ship ignition. Stage separation. Use back burn startup. All right, successful hot staging maneuver. So we've got 12 of the 13 engines lit back up on booster. So it's doing its boost back real, real excitingly ship though. We've got six out of six Raptors lit on ship there. So it's now gonna continue to make its ascent into- And as we're starting to get into the denser part of the atmosphere, the booster is using four hypersonic grid fins to guide itself through atmospheric entry towards its landing site. And we're just ship about 20 seconds away from landing burn start where we'll ig first ignite the center 13 engines then bring that down to five to slow down the booster for landing and finally that will come down to three and we'll cut all of them off while we're still about 200 meters in the air so booster is gonna see a bit of a part of it booster landing we're sort of down we saw a 13 to 5 to 3 v3 v3 demonstration and into the water we go yeah and any, anybody that's been following starship you know starlink's kind of the mvp for these flight tests where it's not only giving us the views we're seeing right now uh, but also just real-time data through every phase of flight so We've got a couple dozen cameras on Starship. We've also got a bunch of cameras spread across the globe, including out in the Indian Ocean where we've got our fun buoys floating. There goes another one. And I mean, we're, we're using Starlink to bring all of this together. It's our, our drone shots you see here uh, from our great team down here at Starbase, all connected. So Starlink 
not only giving us cool views off the planet, but also on the planet, help bring everybody along for all these starship flights. Raptor ignition. And shut down. All right, there was that Raptor relight. Looks like engine three, full duration. As Dan mentioned, that's the third attempt, and we just did it three times in a row. So congrats to the team, the ship Nominal team, Raptor orbital. team. And then there we were, nominal second orbital insertion. All right, so congrats everyone on the milestone. Vehicle is now at maximum dynamic pressure. All right, that was basically our reverse max Q. So most aerodynamic stress that it's going to see during re-entry, we just passed through it. So we're past that, we're past peak heating. Shipping is, the ship is making its turn for final approach. And here's this kind of aggressive final turn that would essentially position it. So it's right behind the launch and catch tower. Flaps holding strong. Landing burn in just under 20 seconds. Ship landing startup. There's our landing burn. Three down to two. Starship has landed.